Hey everyone, welcome back. Welcome back, hope all is well. This is still Dr. Obama Bowen, and it is still 2021, the year of the one thing. And my one thing this year I choose is growth. What is your one thing? What's your one thing? Drop a comment down below what your one thing is. What's the one thing for you? Maybe it's the one thing that's gonna fulfill you this year. Drop your one thing in the comment. And my one thing, as I said, is growth. So here's my definition of growth for you. Growth is consistently getting out of your current comfort zone. Because as we continue to grow and do whatever it is we're doing in life, in business, and health, and success, you name it, you will grow and you will get to different plateaus. Thank you all so much for the love. If this makes sense to you, tag someone, share this message with someone. So let's jump into today's topic. As you see above, this is the moment. This is the point where 97% of people quit. Here's why. Number one, discipline. Especially when it comes to the part of health. Let's stick with that because we're still in January and most people who set goals. That is the second part we're going to talk about. One is discipline, two is goals. Hi my friend, thank you so much. But welcome Lisa. Discipline for those who start on the health course. I did a study years ago and some research with LA Fitness. And they mentioned, it was like the local LA Fitness here where I'm at. And they mentioned that most people end up quitting by the 21st. But the 19th is where they start getting all the calls. See, when you set goals, if you set goals, hey Jennifer, hey William, appreciate the love. When you set goals, if you don't break those down, you don't attach an emotional or a reason element to it you start to lose the discipline to continue. So most folks don't really fully set a goal. So if you don't know where you're going, obviously you're never gonna get there. And if you don't have the discipline to do it, by the 21st, you're done. So this is a quick reminder, whatever your goal was that you set, you choose to grow in this year. Tonight, for most people, is when they go to sleep, they start to feel the fatigue of the consistency of doing it and showing up every single day. And they start entertaining that it's getting hard. And if it's starting to get hard, in your mind, whenever you plant a seed, whatever it is about, it grows. So by the time they wake up tomorrow, what happens is they may just oversleep. Hey, Don, welcome. Thank you. They may have just overslept and say, oh, you know what? I'll go to the gym later, or I'll go to the gym tomorrow, or, oh man, I didn't lay out my clothes last night, so now yeah, I'll just go tomorrow. Well, tomorrow's the 20th, and you don't go the 21st, it happens. 97% of people start to quit on their goals. Do you know why? Because you're almost there. It takes 21 days to create a new habit. This close, don't fall back. Don't fall down. Keep growing. Remember, if you don't grow, you become the person that lives a life of apathy. And apathy is a natural human instinct. It's common to us all, and it consistently forces us to seek a comfort zone where nothing ever changes. Remember, you were born as an apex predator. Continue to be. This is Dr. O saying this year, choose growth. Because if you don't choose growth, you'll end up living a life of apathy. If this message reach you, touch you, inspire you, do me a favor, share it on your timeline, share it with a friend, tag a friend, be a blessing to them. Save them from quitting. Help them choose growth today. If you wanna see how we're helping more entrepreneurs with growth this year, go to the year of the one thing, Dot com. God bless. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye for now.